The Untouchables and the Pax Britannica by Baba Sahib Ambedkar Part 31 Paragraph 20 Wealthy classes will not at present support superior education. We may see then how hopeless it is to enforce what your Lordship in Council so strongly enjoined upon us in your letter of the 24th of April 1850, what appears, prima facie, so plausible and proper in itself, what in fact the board themselves have very often attempted, that is, the strict limitation of superior education to the wealthy, who can afford to pay for it, and to youths of unusual intelligence. The invariable answer the board has received when attempting to enforce a view like this has been that the wealthy are wholly indifferent to superior education and that no means for ascertaining unusual intelligence among the poor exist until their faculties have been tested and developed by school training. A small section from among the wealthy classes is no long is no doubt displaying itself by whom the advantages of superior education are recognized, it appears largely in Bengal, where education has been long for fostered by government than in Bombay. And we may think it inevitable that such class must increase with the experience that superior attainments lead to distinction and to close intercourse with Europeans on the footing of social equality. But as a general proposition at the present moment, we are satisfied that the academic instruction in the arts and sciences of Europe cannot be based on the contribution either of students or of funds from the opulent classes of India. The end.